Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, so today I'm showing you the Galaxy Note, or sorry, Galaxy Tab 2, that would be cool if it was a Note, uh, Galaxy Tab 2 uh, 4.1 update. So this recently got Jelly Bean, and if you ever saw it before it had Jelly Bean, you could tell it looks really, really different. Um, so this does give a more of a, you know, Nexus 7 kind of look that we've seen to 7-inch tablets um, as they've evolved. Uh, so it has a 7-inch uh, interface, uh, which is pretty nice. Um, it gives you a little bit more real estate space, uses the screen better, and uh, does a really good job of it. So let's go over some of the differences. So first of all, our clock is no longer here at the bottom. It's actually up at the top, just like our phones uh, tend to be. Let me zoom in a little bit for you guys. So, we have it. So our clock's over here at the top, and instead of it being over here, our icons have moved from the left side to the middle, which is again just a, a nicer uh, way of looking at the device. Now we still have our mini app tray right here at the bottom, which has not gotten bigger yet, but hopefully we're hoping it does. Uh, but it's still easy to access quick apps like calculator, calendar, email, music player, um, task manager on top of whatever else you're doing. So it's pretty nice for that feature. Now, if we move up to the top, we now, just like we do on our uh, regular Android devices, have a notification panel over here at the top which is just a nicer feature um, that you have the drop down menu just like you do in other devices so it's just really nice for that purpose and of course you can go across and see your other notifications so let's go into settings because a lot of stuff has changed in the settings section so when we go over the settings um, we have first of all Wi-Fi Direct is now in Wi-Fi so it used to be under the more settings section, but now it is under the Wi-Fi direct section. So um, that's just one important thing to note is that your Wi-Fi direct is there now. Under more settings, um, we don't have anything too much except uh, for to be able to share uh, through DLNA and of course through Keys Wi-Fi. Now under uh, here we have devices, we have a new mode which is called blocking mode. This can basically disable any notifications from a certain time to a certain time, or always when you switch, make the switch. So this is just a really nice feature, so if you're on vacation, or even just when you go to bed, you don't want to be interrupted, uh, or woken up by your tablet, this allows you to do that. Under sounds, um, nothing really has changed. Um, you can still do just the basics. Uh, brightness wallpaper. Uh, now you can display uh, your battery percentage at the top. Um, that is one thing that was added to it. Storage, nothing changed. Power save mode. Again, this one can just limit your uh, processor, so that's a really nice feature about it. It just adds more battery life to it. Um, other than that, nothing changed there, nothing changed there. Lock screen mode has changed. So now under our lock screen mode, we have different options than we did before. So one, it added a fifth uh, shortcut, which before you had three icon or four icons you could use, now you can add five. Um, so you have another icon row. You do have the information ticker, which allows you to use news, um, Facebook, or oops, news, Facebook, or um, other things uh, such as uh, weather uh, or stocks um, as a ticker. Um, you do, of course, have weather and the ability to um, auto refresh. And under security, um, nothing too, nothing new there. As well as on language and input, although your voice to text and voice speech is greatly increased now that it is Android 4.1, you have a much better uh, voice detection, voice to text detection. Um, other than that, nothing too much else. Nope, that is it in the settings. So as you can see, this is Android 4.1.1, and this is the uh, Tab 2 7-inch, and that is P3113, and of course this is the U.S. version. So, um, another important thing, just wanted to see if they did change anything here. Nope, nothing changed on the gallery. 
Um, so, uh, nothing changed too much besides that, except for just the look and feel, you know, it is much quicker than it was before. Things just move a bit quicker, a bit easier. Of course, um, it has landscape as well, so you can view things this way, which tends to move things better, um, even on 7 inches. Android, you can tell, is very used to being on landscape, and that's just how it's typically seen. Uh, for uh, Whether it be 7 inches or 10 inches, it just seems to move a little bit quicker um, when it comes to uh, moving uh, from screen to screen. And uh, the last thing I just want to go over, of course, is Google Now. So you do have Google Now if you just hold this home button and swipe up. You do have Google Now, which is just an excellent uh, voice detection, and it kind of learns uh, everything uh, that you kind of do to help you out better from telling you when your shipping packages are coming in to telling you how long it's taking to get home and etc. So it just has a lot of uh, fun features for you. So this has been the new update to Android 4.1 on the Galaxy Tab 2 uh, 7 inch. If you have any questions about it, feel free to ask. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.